Welcome to Awakening You channel. If you appreciate what we do, please support us. Thank you. Channel, AS. My dearest brothers and sisters, this is Hakan speaking. I greet you in peace and love. Many people on earth compare themselves to others. This is understandable, because that's what culture and media train you to do. However, there's a reason for the saying comparisons are the thief of joy. Is there some entrepreneur or light worker or spiritual teacher or healer or YouTuber out there who is more spiritually advanced or more successful than you are? Are there people out there who contribute more than you do, or who have more peace of mind or more so-called supernatural powers than you do? Yes, most likely. Among a population of billions, it is pretty unlikely for a given person to be the very best in the world at something. But the thing is, you can always find someone who is better at something than you are. And note that most likely you are also better at certain things than this other person is. Even if someone else is better than you at something, that doesn't mean that you are not good, or that you are not good enough. Compared to the average person on earth, or to the average soul in the universe, Light workers are miles ahead of them already. You're more spiritually advanced, more psychologically at ease, the sleepers suppress a lot which makes them seem level-headed but they're really not, and contributing much more than the average person is. Compared to the average person, you're doing great and you're miles ahead of them. You're also more than good enough. This is both in terms of everyone being inherently good enough, and also in terms that you are contributing enough to this liberation effort. Light workers are succeeding, this liberation process is working. It's just that it's a complex process and it takes time. But it's working. You are succeeding. Most of you think that I, Hacken, am capable and am good enough as a person. Well, I could say no, I'm not good enough because for example Ashta Sharon is better than me at a bunch of things, and also he has contributed more than I have. And technically that would be true. He is, and he has. But still you would still not see me as broken or flawed or bad or incapable, just because someone else is better than me at certain things. Right? Similarly, we're not viewing you as insufficient at all, even if you are a so-called average light worker. Even a so-called average light worker is an amazing individual, who has accomplished a lot, and in fact far more than most people on earth have. If you regularly listen to these kinds of messages, you're most likely a light worker. Moreover, if you're physically on earth at this time, you're connected to the collective subconscious of earth humans, which is currently very dark and heavy. Hence some of the heaviness and so-called negative and painful emotions and thoughts that you're experiencing, aren't even your own. So if you occasionally feel bad, that's not even necessarily something that comes from you. You might just be providing a huge service to humanity by transforming and releasing that heaviness, for all of humanity. And everyone is benefiting from you doing that. That's not you being bad, that's you being amazing. Great job. You're helping out the human collective in a huge way. Also keep in mind that almost everyone is struggling in some way. Most people just aren't open about that. So if you're struggling, well I empathize with you, but also you're very much not alone. If you're struggling, then you're not the exception, you're the norm. So to everyone who is not doing great, I empathize but doing great is almost an unrealistic standard to have right now. I'm not saying that you shouldn't try to improve your situation, of course you should. I'm just saying that if you are currently not doing great, then that doesn't mean you're not broken. You're actually doing better than most already. Life on Earth is just really tough right now. If you must compare yourself, please compare yourself to who you were five years ago. Most likely you will have learned a whole bunch of things and you will have grown significantly as a person. Right? So, great job. You're doing very well. Even if your external circumstances now are worse than they were five years ago, 
most likely you will have grown significantly as a person in the meantime. Yes, people are responsible for their lives, but it's also true that the economic situation is very bleak right now. And it's not your fault that for example grocery prices have shot up. The external circumstances of Earth humans are almost certainly going to improve dramatically in the future. So even if all you can do right now is hang on, well, that's enough. And any little thing you can do beyond just hanging on, whether that's spiritual practice or healing work or integration work or journaling or helping someone or improving your practical situation in some way, well, that's amazing. Great job at doing that. You're doing well. Better times are ahead. I respect you and I love you. Your star brother, Hacken for Era of Light.